this is just an additional video to the tuning and fine tuning video I made before uh, where we talked about the mixture screw and how many turns you should have the mixture screw out from fully in um, as a good starting point for fine tuning. And we said that three turns out um, on a Dyna, on a um, Twink M88 uh, with a 45 slow jet, the stock slow jet, uh, three turns out is a good starting point once you refurbish your carb or you clean it out. Um, of course, provided that you got, um, you know, open exhaust, screaming eagle or whatnot, and um, high flow air cleaner. So three turns out is a good starting point. And as you're fine tuning it, you'll probably find that three and a quarter, three and a half, maybe three and three quarters will be the sweet spot for you depending on your bike. Um, well, it may not be the case for all carburetors, and I'll show you why. So this one here, I'm gonna turn it full in. As you can see, the uh, tip of the mixture screw is only sticking out just a little bit, maybe a millimeter. Um, on this one, it's got an easy adjust mixture screw, um, but makes no difference really. I look at the difference. It's sticking out like two millimeters at least. So obviously on this carburetor, um, the three turns out is not going to be enough. And I actually I tested this bike and it wasn't even idling or anything um it started off but really high idle because it was really lean so i ended up turning it out four and a half to make it run you know reasonably nice um so on this one this is a busted carburetor but i put a mixture screw in just to check it out and full in, you can just about see the tip of the mixture screw leveling the carburetor throat. So this would be around two turns out and running probably okay. So um, it's a good idea just to check if you don't know, you know, what setting you had or you're refurbishing a carburetor. Um, turning it full in until it seats and count the number of turns. I'm going to count the number of turns until the tip levels with the carburetor. So this one is half, one, and a quarter. So one turn and a quarter. And it's leveled with the uh, throat. And I know for a fact that the uh, carburetors um, I've tuned before uh, with a similar threads, you know, in a mixture screw, uh, one and a quarter leveling, um, worked out around three and a quarter, running great. This one, we're going to count number of turns, half. One, one and a half, two, and a quarter. So two and a quarter. So one full turn more than this one. Also matters, you know, what sort of mixture screw you're using. This one has a um, stock mixture screw. And this is an aftermarket easy adjust. And I measured the tapered um, end of the mixture screws. And this one is much thinner. The stock one is thinner than the uh, aftermarket one. So obviously this one needs more, a little bit more turn because it's uh, thicker. So, which is why it came about four and a half turns, this one, um, and it, it was running okay. My carburetor um, has 
one and three quarters to level it. And right now I'm running it actually, I used to run it at three and a quarter. Now I, I, um, I, I increased it by a quarter, three and a half, and another quarter because I wasn't happy with the um, idling when I, when the bike was warming up. So uh, three and three quarters is really nice and a little bit rich, but I like it that way. So anyway, I hope uh, this video helps you guys. And I'll see you soon.